number one. First and foremost, we're going to give all praise down and glory to Yahweh, Baal Shem, El Shai, Baal Shem, Makar Kadash, the bonds, the apostles, elders, the great millstone, and citation and brothers, and pushing his word and truth and sincerity over charity and grace from the lives and spirit and tradition. Um, topic is uh, if you love me, keep my commandments. All right. Because a lot of people say that they love the Lord, but hey, what is love? All right. Um, these people don't love the Lord. By their actions, it shows that they really hate the Lord. All right. They, they don't fear the Lord. All right. Um, they lean, on to, um, lean unto their own understanding. Matter of fact, let me start off with that. This is Book of Proverbs, chapter 14, verse 12. It says, There is a way which seemeth right unto a man, but the end thereof are the ways of death. All right. Hey, as the scripture says, everything written in four times written for our learning. All right. Hey, the Lord gave us commandments. All right. Law, statutes, and commandments to. Uh, Keep forever, man. All right, and um, let me get it. For what is love? Because a lot of people say they love the Lord, but how do you show you the Lord? Uh, you love Him. This is uh First John five and three. It says. Let me just start at one. It says, Whosoever believeth that Yahweh Shai is Mashiach and is born of the Most High, and every one that loveth him, that begot loveth him also that is begotten of him. By this we know that we love the most, we, it's like we love the children of the Most High, when we love the Most High and keep his commandments. For this is the love of the Most High, that we keep his commandments, and his commandments are not grievous. All right, so they're not grievous, man, but to two thirds of our people, they are grievous. All right, they say they love the Lord. They go to church every Sunday. They, they give thanks. They about to. They, hey, they got turkey uh, marinating in the fridge right now. About to give thanks to the Lord. Man, these people is nuts. All right, they don't love the Lord. All right. If you love the Lord, you keep his commandments and they're not grievous. All right. This is the book of John, chapter 14, verse 15. If you love me, keep my commandments. All right. And scripture says that we are considered his friends. We, let's find the next, next chapter. This is John 15. And 14, it says, Ye are my friends if ye do whatsoever I command you. Alright? So, <laughs> if we're not doing anything that the Lord commanded us to do, then we're his enemy. But if we do the things that we are ought to do, or what he told us to do, we are counted as friends. So if you love the Lord, you keep his commandments. All right, and we are rehearsing the righteous acts. Uh, matter of fact, this is the book of Judges, chapter 5, verse 11. It says, They that are delivered from the noise of archers in the places of drawing the water, there shall they rehearse the righteous acts of the Lord, even the righteous acts towards the inhabitants of his village in Israel. Then shall the people of the Lord go down to the gates. All right, so we are rehearsing the righteous acts, man. We're not going to get it perfect. We are in the flesh. But if we love the Lord, through that, we have to keep his commandments. And these people don't love the Lord, man. It's evident just by their actions. This is Deuteronomy chapter 4, verse 6. It says, keep therefore and do them. 
Rashi. Verse 5. Deuteronomy chapter 4, verse 5. It says, Behold, I have taught you statutes and judgments, even as the Lord my power commanded me that ye should do so in the land where ye go to possess it. Keep therefore and do them, for this is your wisdom and your understanding in the sight of the nations, which shall hear all these statutes and say, Surely this great nation is a wise and understanding people. All right. The Lord only gave his laws and commandments unto Israel. No one else. That alone should want you to uh, strive to keep his commandments. Shit, these niggas is just out here wicked, man. This is Psalms 147 and 19. He says, he, uh, it says, He showeth his word unto Jacob, his statutes and his judgment unto Israel. He had not dealt so with any nation, and as for his judgments, they had not known them. Praise ye to Lord. These other nations did not keep the commandments. They weren't given to the to, to uh, given un, uh, unto them, man. It was given unto us. All right. So in, in order to show the Lord that we love Him, we have to keep and strive to keep His commandments, rehearse His rights, His acts, and not lean unto our own understanding. You know, we go. Uh, 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 filter everything out through the scriptures. Go back to the scriptures. Go do this. If we are about to do that, do that. We filter out through the scriptures, all right? All right? But, um... <laughs> what is it? Look, just a few, name a few uh, what the Lord commanded us not to do. Not to eat pork. All right? To keep the Shabbat. Not to commit adultery. All right? Not to get lining. All right? These are eight, eight, and Jake does the complete opposite. And they love the Lord, keep his commandments. All right? And they're not done away with. Okay. Bear with me. says five Matthew 5 and 17 says think not that I come to destroy the law or the prophets I am not come to destroy but to fulfill for verily I say unto you till heaven and earth pass one jot or one tittle should in no wise pass from the law till all be fulfilled whosoever therefore shall break one of these least commandments and shall teach men so he shall be called the least in the kingdom of heaven. For whosoever shall do and teach them, the same shall be called great in the kingdom of heaven. Now, I scripture says that we are all to be doers of words and not hearers only. All right, a scripture says that uh, these people draw near to me with their lips, but their heart is far from me. No, man. All right. There's no lip service. We, hey, if you show, if, you know, in order to show the Lord you love Him, you have to strive to keep His commandments. All right, if you love. If, if Scripture says you love me, keep my commandments. Show the Lord you love Him, keep His commandments. All right. So, I'm gonna get off with that. No one's an edifying lesson. Until next time, call for long life. Hope by Shine and Bob the Ball.